Hello guys, and welcome back to 7 Days to Die. Uh, the sun is just now coming up over the horizon, and we got us a couple more buildings to check out today. Um, one of our, if you remember from the last episode, one of the main reasons we're here is to find some yucca plants, which I see everywhere, which is great. Um, but I wanted to check out these two buildings first, so... Let's go ahead and uh, get get going with that. Oh, the other thing I wanted to do was uh, collect as many of these uh, oil barrels as possible. Alright. Let's go ahead and break in here. I guess I guess we never went in here yes, uh, yesterday. So, or, well, last episode. I thought we had, but no biggie. I come to think of it, I think we were kind of running for our lives and trying to get safe. So, uh, yeah. Again, no biggie. Yeah, I know it's kind of dark. It's just, uh, unfortunately how it is inside this house. Alright. Not much in here. Oh, there's an upstairs. Okay. Ooh, another oil barrel. Not too concerned about that zombie. You know what? I bet you we can get that from here. Got it. I better break this one down or there's going to be like a wall safe in here or something that I miss. Well, of course not. Definitely want them empty bottles to make our yucca juice with. Don't need a repair tool. Is there anything over here? Nothing over here. Okay. So we've got this place checked out. And it is not all that interesting. What's up, buddy? Alright. On to the next. Uh, I guess we can go ahead and take this one out. Excuse me, I'm right here. <laughs> Wonder why she was a one shot and the others are taking two shots. I haven't quite figured that out yet because, as far as I can tell, they're all headshots. This is a small little building. Kind of unusual. Yucca. Now, for those of you who don't know, uh, the aloe plants, which are the, the green ones, like this, you can get those and you can make aloe cream out of them, and then you can combine those with uh, just a regular bandage and make one of the healing bandages. But we have plenty of healing bandages. There, we, there's no sense in us even worrying about collecting that stuff. All right. But definitely the yucca. We need the yucca. Where are you guys coming from? Now, something else that um, I'm unsure about is I guess you can chop these things down and you get yucca fruit but I haven't been able to find out what in the heck you do with yucca fruit um, what can I discard? I'll discard that I guess um, I've tried I've tried squeezing it well <laughs> squeezing it I've tried uh, eating it. I've tried everything I can think of, and I can't find a use for it. Uh, I mean, if you could break it down into, you know, like the yucca plant or something like that, and, uh, you know, yield like ten of them or something like that. Oh my goodness, there's a horde. A big horde. Can you guys see that over there? Yeah, 
think we're going to try and stay out of their way. Go ahead and break this down. Check it out real quick if we can. Of course. I hear you off to my right. Dude, apparently I wasn't hitting him. I was hitting whatever was behind me. This is probably not the best this idea. Don't definitely don't need any skinned rabbit right at the moment. Okay, is that all? That's, oh, all right, that's all that's in here. That's a pretty small building. Let's get the heck over here. You know what would be cool? Here, let's try this. Come here, guys. Uh, guys, horde, horde guys, excuse me, okay, so I don't get it, these guys just aren't really paying much attention to me at all, but okay, we're going to go ahead and leave these barrels right here for right now. In, in hopes that we have another horde come through or something, because I want to try and blow up a bunch, bunch of them with um, those oil barrels. Anyway, um, barbed wire. Excuse me. Really? <laughs> that dude must have been under a car on a crawler <laughs> okay bad joke ooh really really bad frame rate my guess is that means there's a horde on its way come on give me that Okay, so here's what I want to do. Well, I want to go in there, but not quite yet. Look at that trap. I think we've ran into one of them before. Alright. I think we got them cleared out. Cleared out enough, at least. don't need any of that stuff right now. Oh, I guess you can eat that. I thought I had tried to eat that before and it just didn't... Huh. Interesting. I could have swore I had, I had tried to eat that before. Oh, look at this. They've already broke down the wall for me. That's nice. Alright, so anyway, um, not really expecting to find too much different in here than what we've seen before. Um, but what I am after is uh, 
you know, and, and the, the reason that I keep searching all this stuff is because I want to find, like, uh, the stuff to make 44 Magnum, the stuff to make a sniper rifle, uh, recipes for the sniper rifle, and so forth and so on. And, uh, because those are some things I just haven't found, simply found yet. So, um, as soon as, uh, get the axe here. As soon as we finish with this building here, I don't think there's another one. Um, we're going to head to the north and uh, try and circle back around. Uh, let's see. Yeah, go back up here to the north and try and circle back around uh, either to here or possibly all the way back over to... Uh, where's our house? Right there. So, yeah, we're just going to play that by ear. Uh, this episode is, you know, I'm not... I'm not really expecting it to be too exciting. Uh, there's going to be a lot of traveling in it, and just some of the same old stuff, unless we happen to uh, run into something new. I mean, which would be great, but um, not to be too pessimistic about it, I'm not really counting on it. So, okay, so we're done in here. Oh, I think there were actually... Was there a room? No. Okay. Some of these gas stations actually have a room that uh, kind of runs behind there. Let's check this car real quick. Again, I would like to have that air filter. Which, can I get rid of anything here? I really don't need corn seeds right at the moment, I guess. So let's go on back over here and get that air filter. That oil drum pick up our other oil drums and start off across the desert to the north. And picking yucca as we go. As a matter of fact, I'm going to go ahead and take these nine yucca I already have and start that. And, oh, and we're running really, really low on food also. Extremely low on food. So, yeah, that's not a real good thing. Okay, and then, alright, so that does give us the empty bottles back, good. Alright, here we go. Head off this direction, and just like I said, we're just going to pick yucca as we go. Try and get us like a stack of yucca, that would sure be nice. Um, before we get out of the desert. There's a jackrabbit. Uh, what the heck? That was, the stupid rabbit just killed himself. Okay, well, I'm not going to take any of that with me. That was, he sounded so much like a freaking zombie, did you hear that? That squeal? Anyway, um... I'm kind of curious if, you know, mo most everything I found in the game has always been on roads. I'm kind of curious if there are things just out here randomly in the middle of the desert, for example. Or, you know, any of the other biomes. If there's just stuff that, you know, buildings or possibly some sort of a well, for lack of a better word, a town or, like, uh, just a little community or something like that. Something with more than three houses, you know, structures or whatever that we've been finding. Um, not that those aren't neat and everything, it's just, I'm just curious if there are other things to spawn. Or that can spawn. All right, we are doing good on the yucca now. Not quite sure how many we've gotten, but we've gotten a few. Excuse me. Asshole. All right, better get that stuff bandaged up real quick.
Very nice. All right. Um. Are you kidding me? Here I was making fun of a stupid rabbit. And I went and did the same thing he did, only I didn't get to kill myself. Can of soup stock. We'll definitely take that. Oh, goodness. What can we get rid of? Let's put that back for just a second and turn our cans into scrap. That'll at least open up a, a spot. Can of salmon. I think that's the first one of those I've seen. Again, what do we get rid of? I don't want to get rid of my lead. Lead seems to be pretty precious. And we're definitely not going back for that. What? Okay, looks like we're coming up on a new biome here. So that being said, we have 27 yucca. I would have liked to get a full stack, but I'm not going to stick around here on camera and do it. I can always come back over here later if, uh, if I need more. Um, you know what? This might be that biome I was... No, it's not. This is the same as this one down here. I was going to say, I think this was the biome that I was wanting to find for, to, to build our base. And you know what? If I'll make a deal with you guys. If, if I don't find that biome in this episode, then before I make the next episode, I will do off-camera playing and find that biome because, yeah, this is a lot of running around for... Uh, you know, basically doing the same thing. I mean, and we're this is episode nine now, I believe, maybe even ten, and um, you know, we just keep seeing the same old stuff over and over. And I and I'm sure you guys are probably getting a little bored with that. Um, and I and I completely understand. So. That being said, I don't think this road is going to take us where I want to go. Because like I said, I want to kind of wrap around. But it doesn't wrap around. It just goes down through the desert. You know what? Let's go cross country. Let's head cross country back towards the city down here. Where our flag is. Why not? We're never going to know whether or not something spawns out here unless we go cross-country anyway. And who knows? I mean, this... There might be, like, military bases or something like that, and maybe that's where you got to find the uh, sniper rifle stuff and, you know, the MP5, SMG, that type of stuff. There's a crawler. There's a rabbit. Let's go ahead and kill this crawler. Just for kicks. Yep. Thank you very much. Another one. Maybe not. All right. Well, let's keep on a going, I guess. I 
I kind of like this cliff face. Ooh, I like that. Just wish it was a lot taller. But yeah, see, it's only a couple high. If that was like four or five high, this whole thing would be perfect place to make a base, in my opinion. All right. Ooh ooh ooh. We're seeing some new terrain here. Nice, nice. We're still in the same kind of biome? Yes. Hmm. Kind of intrigued as to what we'll be able to see from up here. <gasps> Whoa! That was close. That was really close. I did not expect it to be a peak like that. <laughs> Alright, well, there's a road. Um. Wow. Yeah, I just about ran right off the edge of this thing. That would have definitely broke a leg if not killed me outright. Alright, well, this road should take us back to uh, to the city. Now, I could have swore I just saw a blueberry right there. I know there are blueberries in certain biomes. Um, you know, come to think of it, though, I think they're only in the snow biome. Uh, I don't, I'm not sure why that is. Is it do... Uh, I mean, what's the deal, or what's the correlation between blueberries and snow? I haven't, I haven't got a clue. Yeah, okay, well, we're seeing... We're seeing more zombies all of a sudden. Oh, good yucca juice. Hmm. Ow. Uh. 44 magnum parts. Yes, thank you. And food. Um, 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 um. Um, um, um. You know what? I'm going to drop some bandages. But we definitely got our 44 Magnum parts, right? Yes. Awesome. So now we need, I think, three more pieces. I think we need the, uh, the handle, or the hand grip, the, uh, I think they call it a casing? I think they called it a 44 Magnum casing. And, um, the, uh, oh my gosh, I'm having such a brain, brain fart right at the moment. I cannot remember the names of these things. Um, the cylinder, and then obviously the recipe. Actually, I think we got the recipe. I'm pretty sure we found, uh, Enforcer Magazine already. All right. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and do a quick save again real quick because uh getting a little bit of lag and that always worries me that the game's going to freeze up and I'm going to uh, lose my progress again. Alright. Show me some more bags. Come on. More bags. More bags. Okay, so apparently I've I've uh, been here before. I can't have been here before. So I guess that was just empty to begin with. That's kind of strange. But, um, 
Yeah, this has been a pretty boring episode, guys. I really apologize for this. And as a matter of fact, I'll probably... Uh, and you'll know, because I think I've been recording now for about 30 minutes. And I... If I cut it down to about 20 minutes, you'll know right away that I definitely cut out a lot of stuff. Um, because, yeah, just not much is going on, and it's just uh, traveling and seeing the same old stuff right at the moment. But uh, we're going to make our way back to the, to the town, to our apartment, and... Uh, call that the end of the episode. So... I am just so surprised we haven't found... I mean, I really like those mountains back there that I just about fell off of. I think that's really cool looking and everything. But, that's not the biome that I want. Oh, there's a house. Okay, actually, let's check these out real quick, and then call it an episode. Yeah, here. We gotta have an explosion. Gotta have an explosion. How many did it take out? Are you kidding me? You are still walking? Okay, that didn't do as well as I thought it was going to. Say what? Alright, shotgun time. Uh, you know what? Didn't I make this mistake last time? We are running really low on ammo. So it's time to go melee. Alright. Yeah, I did make that mistake last time, didn't I? That grass has already started growing here. Ain't that neat? Serious? All right, lady. Okay, that's just a little cabin. There's not much in those. I mean, well, I mean, not much to actually look through. Now, this is a pretty good sized house here. Three stories, it looks like. Dude, die. Okay, no front door. So either they've already broke it. Oh, check this out. There's a chest in here. What? This looks like stuff... We've been here before. Oh my goodness. Alright, well, I feel a little retarded. Um... Yep, I sure have been here before. Okay, well that's that's pretty awesome actually. Take those. All right. So here's what I'm going to do, guys. I'm going to cook up this venison that I have in here, 
Um, I'm going to make me a forge. Um, cook up some of the, the iron that I have. Repair my... Uh, oh, wait. Actually, probably make a spiked club again. Because I got rid of it when I got those magnum parts, I'm pretty sure. Yes, I did. Um, and then I'm going to do off-camera searching for uh, the biome that I want. And uh, so next episode, hopefully I've found that biome. And we're going to start building. Um, I'm also going to try and collect up some, um, you know, just some supplies and whatnot, you know, for food and, and uh, drink and so forth and so on. So, guys, thanks for joining me, and I really apologize for the uh, for how boring this episode was. Um, there just really wasn't a lot going on. So, um, again, thanks for joining me, and I will see you next time.